Bro. Everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a um simple makeup tutorial for those of you out there who aren't really for the whole glammed up look all the time. So I'm just going to do something very simple. So I've already done my brows. Now I'm gonna just jump straight into um priming my lids and setting them and getting on with the eyeshadow. So let's go. So basically right here, I'm just getting my LA Girl Pro in the color Fawn and putting it all over my lids and blending it in with my Beauty Blender. Blend, 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 blend. And now I'm setting it with the Laura Mercier setting powder, translucent setting powder. I'm just putting that um, all over my eyes. Now with the Juvia's Place. I'm taking the color Morocco and I'm using it slightly above my crease. Do you see me? Do you see me? Yes, get that girl. Y'all, excuse the background. I just moved. Things aren't in place yet. So now I'm using the Morphe 350 palette and I'm going to take like this really pretty spicy. Spicy caliente red rojo I'm using that red and I'm getting right in that crease Adding that definition just really defining it, you know, I Don't know So yeah blending that in blending those two pretty colors Y'all are so pretty So so pretty Go girl go girl Y'all, these braids literally be having me about to break my neck. So now I'm going in with this auburn curler in my crease. Just adding that definition. After greatly defining that, you're going to go in with some LA Girl Pro and the color Fawn for my cut crease. And I'm just taking this flat brush from, I want to say Walmart. So I'm just going in with my little half moon shapey thing itch itch so when i do my cut crease i like to go a little bit above my crease just so it could look like a my eye could look bigger i guess i don't know but they're already big but you know like who doesn't want bigger eyes i guess they're beautiful i just like to go a little bit above my crease really get it really neat as you can see and I hold my high lashes and I try not to look up because if you look up, it's going to be like messed up. So you go try to look down as much as possible. Then you just go on like with a matte, whatever I prefer, like, a you know, like a nude shade to really cover the lid. So I just cover the lid all the way up. Make sure you get into like the little cracks up there and stuff. You don't want it to be all creasy. So I make sure I just really cover that up, you know. Cut creases are my favorite, by the way. So now I'm going to take this Caliente Red and put it at the end of my cut crease. Mm, that didn't work out. Let's try another color. So now I'm going in with this dark brown color, just fading out my cut crease, you know. Okay, 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 I see you. Queen A in the building, honey. Now we're taking these Equay Wipes from Walmart and just cleaning up under the eyes. Just removing the excess eyeshadow out of the way. Swipe, swipe, swipe. Now I'm going in with this Urban Decay. And mixing it with the L'Oreal True Match. Taking my Real Technique Beauty Blender. Just putting it all over my face. I hate how some things look better off camera than on camera, but hey, it is what it is. So now I'm going in with my, why do I look like that? <laughs> so now I'm going in with my LA Girl Pro from um, the Beauty Supply in the color Fawn. Just getting that up under that eye. Y'all, these braids, they're beautiful, don't get me wrong. But they're a job to deal with. They are a job. 
look at me flipping every 10 seconds so also from the la pro girl um line i'm taking warm honey just to add a little bit more highlight under my eyes and i'm blending that in with my real techniques beauty blender blend 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 back at it again with the lower mercy yeah honey yes we are setting that setting that and setting that ready set and go honey we're setting that with the lower mercy air translucent powder just making sure my makeup lasts all day long so i will now be using the black radiance true complexion contour palette and i'll just be taking those two shades to contour so I like to do like um, little circular motions just to really get that full effect of the contour. Okay, now to set my other highlighted areas, I'll be taking the Sephora um, foundation powder, I want to say. And I'm just setting those places where I highlight it because I don't want to look like a ghost. So I just really like set that just to bring the color back. Now for the lashes, I'll be using the, I want to say Big Colossal Mascara from Maybelline. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Getting my lower lashes. So now I'm going in my tear duct with this gold shimmery color. And now on the cheeks with that wet and wild crown of my canopy highlight. It is the bomb. And I hate this lighting so much and now I'm going to my nose I do my nose my cubis bow um of course my cheeks or whatever that is in my forehead and my eyebrows and stuff now I'm going on my nose with this little brush because I want that real definite um highlight on my nose Y'all, I really apologize for this fuzzy, unfocused look. But my phone died and I had to rely on my good old iPad. That wasn't focusing, but thank God for my iPad. So I just took like this lighter peachy color and I'm going on my eyebrow arch and I'm just highlighting my brow bone. All right, all right these freaking braids getting on my freaking nerves crown of my canopy wet and wild highlight and now i'm highlight highlighting my brow bone i just love looking like a golden egg y'all and more highlight do y'all see that on my cheek like what's good look at that highlight Yes, I'm going in with some kiss lashes from HEB. I'm going in with my dark brown NYX lip liner, and my lip color is one of Milani's matte lipsticks in the shade Adorable. Y'all gotta check them out, they're really, really pretty and moussey, and they smell so good like, really, really good. And they retail for like seven bucks. So I'm just really defining my lip line. Okay, feeling myself okay. All right, all right. Yes, for that highlight. Yes. Now I'm going in with Crown of My Canopy and Precious Petal. They're both wet and wild highlights. And just lining up my cupid's bow. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. See you next video. It's more than like just sleeping in and getting high with you I had to let go of us to show myself what I could do And that just didn't sit right with you